What's up, y'all? I'm June Landy. Welcome to the ULM Warhawks. And today we're taking on the University of Virginia, who is uh, not as good as us. So not that I'm expecting an easy game, but this should be a dub. We are ranked number six in the country. I want to move up into that top five. All right, Izzy. Looking for a big return here. Oh, look at this beautiful seam for Izzy McGriz. Yeah, this is definitely not Virginia Tech. This is Virginia already. And see, was it the Cavaliers? The Cavaliers side of the field. Yeah, Damian Marshall, massive game. It was literally the Andrew Carpenter and uh, what's his name? Damian Marshall show last week. 200 total yards between them rushing. So, oh, man. Is McGriz on the jet sweep? Might as well start the game off with it. Casey McGriz does not run that well. If you didn't know, we run one jet sweep at least one a week. And I can't wait for the day we actually get a touchdown out of it. And who is my read here? I low-key kind of don't know. Does it really matter? Because Andrew Carpenter is going to take it the distance. He's a Heisman candidate for a reason. That reason right there. He has done that so many times this year. I mean, was it his second first play from scrimmage? was like a 60-yarder or something. Oh, yeah, like and subscribe to watch this unfold. We are the ultimate underdog story. We got the true freshman Andrew Carpenter doing incredible things. You just never know what might happen this season. We are now top five, and he fumbles that, and he's going to trip. This is a team? This is a team? We're about to blitz. Where are they? At the one-yard line? Uh, Right up the middle. We're just going to uh, guess run up the middle, get try to get a safety here, get the ball back, and put this game away early. Run up the middle. Jacob Montgomery had a chance to get him. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. David Davis. Almost a 99-yard touchdown. Okay, I got to calm down. Okay, so Virginia can do some things on offense. Oh, I'm trying to switch around. No pass rush. Craig Jelks, fine. That's not Craig Jelks. Who was that? Is that Summers? Joey Summers, Loki having an amazing... It's not really summer, it's fall. So it gets the sack, and they're going to take the field goal here? Yo, it's a 50-yard field goal. Shout out to this kicker if he can make that. Hey, every once in a while, I get some random kicker that just has a bomb of a leg. And this is not one of them. Well, I guess technically would have been long enough, but he missed it wide left. Stretch play. I'm not the biggest fan of it here, because I don't think we're going to steal that edge. When, and we weren't. Third and nine. This is not good. We tried another running play. Got like two yards. Can I get this out there fast with Debo? Yes, we can. He has a rocket arm. I just love utilizing it. I mean, just great move on the outside. And Carpenter put it on the money. Now, four verts here. Looking at Izzy McGriz. If he just plays with him. Oh my goodness. I'll... Good job by the safety. Go up the field, Damien. Go up the field, Damien. I see you. Perfect. Damien. Marshall. Bounces. Outside 10. Inside the 10. To what? The 6 or 7 yard line. And we're already back in uh, the red zone. First and goal. Just give this to Damien Marshall. Had a good receiving play. Now he's going to power his way through not one but two Cavaliers into the end zone. We take a two score lead. I got to be a little careful. Virginia could surprise me. But I think we're going to take this one big. Okay, Virginia Tech moving down the field. Screen pass on 3rd and 13. What are they thinking? This is why you're 2-3. and three. Now they're going to say 4th and 24. Jackson Bailey with the sack. Shout out to him. Senior. Pumping up the crowd. Trying to get in this kicker's head. Is he going to miss? Or is he going to make this one? Ah, right, he drills this one. Shout out to him. Alright, uh, this is a team I think we can take a kick re a kick return back. I can't talk right now. But we can do a kick return. Oh, I tried to cut inside, but that's okay. 45 yards. And let's see. Uh, let's see how much we can dominate this team by. Uh, They get the ball to start in the second half. Izzy, I have a feeling. Go deep. Go deep. I just have a feeling. Yep. Single coverage. Izzy. Bomb. Touchdown. One play. One touchdown. This is crazy. Of course, when you have 98 speed, one on one, launch it. It's like having Tyree Kill on your team. Another third down. Except this one will be a quick three and out. They got actually a really good return. Oh, we can get another sack. What is this throw? Hodges! 
Cam make the play. Is that actually dropped? No, I think Hodges got a hand on it. Fourth down, they're punting, and we get the ball back again. Potentially to go up 28-3. to Now, we've heard those numbers before, but uh, uh, Virginia showed me... After oh my goodness, what a terrible punt. Virginia showed me nothing. Nothing. Okay. Defensively, definitely not. Offensively, they had that one drive that they got a field goal on. Other than that, there's reason they're two and three. Uh, I don't love this play, not gonna lie, but it's gonna work out. Okay, well, back to throw. Hold on, hold on. Is he? How did he even get that throw off? First of all, uh, what an interception. Okay, okay. Well, Virginia, they did something to go their way. Another third down. It's a screen pass. Parrish is there. Another three and out. First and ten. Let's let's play it safe and just run the ball. I think that's a little bit, little bit better. Six yards. Take a breath. Let's actually make this the final drive. Let's just run the ball. Let's just run the ball. Nothing crazy. Got to have this be the last drive of the half. Can hopefully go up twenty-eight uh, to three going into halftime. That would be quite the quite the start. Kevin Marshall up the middle. Running through people. Under two minutes to go here. We are going to throw here in second down. Uh, I see so many people open, but Andrew Carpenter can get so much more just running and slide tackling safeties. It's about as perfect a drive as could be. And actually, we're going to score here. I'm actually going to go down at the one yard line because I want to kill the clock. And then run it in right here. Not with a toss. Oh, a little read option. That'll be fun. Let's do that. Now, should I just score the touchdown? Yes, probably. But Carpenter's going to get it right here. We're able to kill off an extra, like, 30, 40 seconds. And just like that, we'll be up 28-3 to 3 at halftime. UVA is 0 for 3 on third down. And uh, we're going to make it 0 for 6. I'm oh, sorry, no, 0 for 5. I said 0 for 3. 0 for 6, and what is happening? All of a sudden, we're going at 3 frames a second, and it's going to help out UVA. Don't know what happened there. Another third down. We're going to send a blitz here, though. We want to make this a little bit difficult for him. They pick up the blitz, and they're going to get the first down and more. And they actually might score here. Hello? I hit the pause button. How did he even hit the pause button? Okay. I didn't even know. Well, hey, they actually might score a touchdown here. I mean, I guess shout out to them for doing something decent. I don't even know. Oh, well, I mean, this is uh, what's interesting is they scored. OK, they score here. If they stop us and score again, all of a sudden it's a game. So I actually kind of want this to be a very long, drawn out drive. I thought he's about to take this like 80 yards to the house. So this is, this is exactly what I want to do. Just read options, running the ball here and there. Kill the clock. Kind of like how we did at the end of the game last week or last game we had. Oh, they really don't want Andrew Carpenter to beat them. But they're going to let Damian Marshall do that. I'll tell you, well, not a good run there. But I'm starting to get a little bit nervous, not going to lie. Oh, no. Oh, no. We have to punt. And all of a sudden, I am nervous. Okay, third and five. Since going 0 for 5 there and then 3 for 3. And. Oh, what? Oh, oh, okay, we made the stop. Fourth down. And are they going to punt? They are going to punt. They kind of have to. You know, if they give us the ball there, it's pretty much game over. So we cannot turn the ball over. And we cannot. Oh, I want to punt. This can be really good. Oh, my goodness. They're taking a page out of our book? I just need a long drive here. I used to love this in the Danny Harris series, and I still like it here. Oh, holding, come on. All right, well, that was fun. Uh, are they really going to let Izzy McRiz just go deep right here on them? The answer is yes. I can't get the ball off. He's gone for a touchdown. Cover zero. Just couldn't hold the ball or couldn't throw the ball. Did I do a jet sweep? I, I might have, just in case we'll do one right here. Probably going to have to punt. It's probably not the, the wisest thing to do right here. I should probably try to get a first down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, losing one is not helpful. Again, I see Izzy McGriz maybe singled up. I'm just going to let him go get it. 
Now he's going to go get it. It's actually kind of underthrown. McGriss has to like almost come back for it. Massive first down. Puts us just outside field goal range. About to wrap this one up. Early almost. It's been a pretty uh, quick game, not going to lie. Well, read option. Letting Carpenter go. Oh my goodness, the little juke outside. He takes him. The shoestring tackle, if not for that, might have been gone for, what, his third touchdown of the game? Yeah, third rushing touchdown of the game. All right. Looking at Morris here over the middle. Maybe Mortimer on the comeback. A little play action. It's going to be Morris. Should have been to McRiz. I should have McRiz do a different route uh, instead of that. They were kind of going to the same spot. Didn't love that. Should have ran the ball right there, but that's okay. That's what, play action? Uh, yep. Looking at her own junior, do a slant instead of a drag. Also, looking at McGriz down the sideline. Like I said, McGriz down the sideline. Oh, back in the end zone. What a catch and throw. Two weeks in a row of throwing absolute dots, drops in the bucket. And, and Izzy McGriz dragging the feet. Look at this throw. Now, did he actually get feet in? Can't tell from that angle. Looked like he did. My goodness, it's like 17 barrel rolls. They're not even going to look at it. We're up 35 to 10, and that's the, the clincher, sealer. Eh, this game's over. And there it is. We take the dub versus Virginia. 35 17. They did go down and score. Whoop de doo. We ran out the clock. And you know what? Uh, we looked like a top six, top five team in the country. Taking care of business. Yeah, Anthony Richardson, early Damian Marshall, Izzy McRiz had a great game. Uh, yeah. Overall, very good game. I want to see if we creep into that top five. Wild stats here. Five for nine for 190 yards. It's only, you know, 38 yards per completion. A lot of bombs today. Uh, one interception, two touchdowns. We only threw the ball nine times because we ran the ball how many? 23. Only 26. We did not have that many plays on offense. Their offense was very, like, slow and methodical that we just stopped quite a bit. Uh, 7 for 96 and 2 touchdowns, and 16 for 86 and 1, touch one touchdown for Damian Marshall. Receiving the ball, yeah, Izzy McRiz was our superstar. 3 for 130 and 2 touchdowns. Yeah, it was just bomb city uh, today. Uh, defense, uh, we got a decent amount of sacks. Uh, did we not? I feel like I feel like we did. There's a bunch of, like, covered sacks. Uh, we only got 2 sacks. Oh, uh, we got 3. All right, not bad. From uh, Johnny Murphy, forgot about that one. Overall... Solid game. We won by 18, 35 to 17. Uh, that should put us in the top five. Well, 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 look at this. Reggie Smith coming to the team. Adam Thompson coming to the team. Lawrence uh, easily coming to the team. A couple of recruits ready to visit. Oh, we lost Mike Joseph to Buffalo. Was that the time we were actually really, really going after? Oh, no, David Williams. That's what I was looking, looking at. Uh, we did not move up to number six, but we could with a win versus number 11. And let's take a look at recruiting. Here is Reggie Smith, and he also looks like an incredible quarterback. 90 throw power, 94 speed. That is crazy. 78 accuracy, not the greatest. What also could he do? Not the greatest receiver. Maybe a running back? Cornerback has decent zone coverage. Tackle's not very good. Hit power's not very good. I don't know. We're we'll going to have to play around with Reggie Smith and Adam Thompson. Really good block shed, power move, good power, good speed also. So you know what? I, I'm good with these guys. You know, the end of our... We lost Mike Joseph, that's fine. Recruiting class really starting to come together. Some really solid players now. We have a few. Eric Gooden we could sign. He's kind of new. We're going after him. Uh, Joel Alford would be great. Marcus Booker we got a new guy. Josh Parker. I mean, these guys, nothing incredible. Just really solid overall players. Now, I'm not sure what this guy is. I mean, looking at him, 5'11", 214, that's almost linebacker-ish, but he's not a good tackler. I don't I don't know where he would play. It says an athlete, but I'm not quite sure. Uh, I'll give it an extra 100 points, just might as well use it there. Uh, we still have some guys to go after. Joe May we're trying to go and get. And where's the uh, ready for visit? Who's ready to come to visit? Danny Green, this is a massive one. Yeah, we want him in as soon as possible. All these guys, David Williams, and then these guys, I honestly could not care less. We got Miami coming up next, and look who is going with us to win. That's right. Now, they technically, let's see, we have a, the number six offense in uh, all of college football. We definitely believe that. Our running offense is top 20. Now, what can they do? They can throw the ball. They're top 13 in throwing the ball. Okay. Their defense is nothing to write home about. 
to be honest. They allow over 400 yards a game. Their rush defense is not the greatest. What are their ratings looking like? Okay, so they are loaded in terms of athletes and dangerousness. Well, hey, make sure you like and subscribe for that coming up in just a couple of days. I'm Jim Landy. Thank you for watching, and we will see you next time.